Have you ever accidentally found someone you know on Reddit? Who was it to you? One hung over New Year's Day. I did a double take at this post. Come our crappy des in comments I to this class and viewed from top down which made. Thinking wow, those really look like my friends. And that looks like one of my drinking glasses. Turns out it was posted by someone who had attended by a NYU party the night before. The glasses we use have a small air bubble in the bottom, and not all of them are sealed. So they fill up with soap and never look clean. The person who had posted it looked down and thought that there was a pill in the bottom of the glass. Yes. I had been researching tattoo ideas and saw a very distinctive tattoo on a subreddit, completely unrelated. I ended up going on a date with a girl from a dating app. We get to talking. She shows me a pic of her recent tattoo and wait a minute. I've seen that. To which she immediately gets embarrassed and mumbles something about not looking up any of her. Other posts. She had an OnlyFans lol. Hilarious way to find that out. And no, I'm not going to fucking link it. Don't bother asking. My husband found mine because of a snarky comment I made in our provincial subreddit. It got a couple thousand upvotes and someone in our Discord server posted the link without realizing it was me. Husband read the comment. Apparently immediately thought it sounded like me when I was in a scathing mood and went to the profile. He said he only needed to see the pictures of my fish and our cats to confirm it was me. And then he felt like Batman. All mal. Yeah, I found my now ex-girlfriend's Reddit account on a dating advice sub talking about our relationship, her prior relationships, and all kinds of stuff. I got pretty sensitive about it and it caused some relationship issues. I made a post on the sub, and like hundreds of people told me to break up with her over what her post said. I liked her, though, and we stayed together for a couple more months. Didn't work out in the end. But she's cool. This girl I went on like to dates with. She responded to a comment of mine on a thread about something random. She had a first name that I had never heard before and her username included it. So I was like her. Probably not but I wonder if it's her. Crazy enough it was her. And it was a NSFW account where she posted nudes. Caught me totally off guard. But this was multiple months after the last time we went out and we hadn't spoken since then. Saw someone in a comment section who was also having a rough time feeling supported at my very small college. We started chatting and became friends, then they freaking died this fall. My friend from Reddit who is also struggling here to I walk past the flowers outside her dorm every day and think about how the school won't address their death or the circumstances surrounding it. More than once, count belonging to a friend from high school who posts nudes somewhat frequently with no fling. I think she just does it for the fun of it. And an account from an old co-worker advertising nerve. I wasn't intending to find any of them. By the way, when I was in high school, I didn't have a Reddit account but I lurked on a few subs. One time, I found the Reddit account of a girl I knew Earl on a sub about a niche hobby we shared at the time. Her username referenced a very specific nickname she had. So of course I walked into school the next morning and said I found a Reddit account she looked like a deer in the headlights, and I cracked up. I ran into a friend of mine. I thought it was him based on a common interest sub he posted in, and his username gave him away. He didn't know the Reddit account was mine. I had fun texting a conversation with him while also replying to his post. He started using my talking points from our text conversation as replies to me in our Reddit thread. It was fun as hell watching how ideas spread. Yep. Saw my ex-boyfriend from a million years ago. He made it to the front page with something that was just identifiable enough that I looked at his profile and it was him. Weirdly, in a totally unrelated incident, I saw a guy posting who just reminded me so strongly of his brother that I deep-dived his profile. And it was him. They're both very popular Redditors. And both total dicks. Before I lost my original account, I used my gaming handle. It was a unique one that didn't have numbers or anything in it. Two different occasions. Old online acquaintances from communities I was a part of from around 2007 to about 2017 would occasionally see my name and PM me just to say hi. I'm pretty sure I found a third one myself too, but they didn't reply to me. Yes, 
I found my best friend, their spouse, and my drinking buddy. Basically the three people I know best. One of them uses the same username for everything, and the other two I stumbled upon randomly and could just tell it was them based on their comments and the subs they were active on. I checked to see what they're up to from time to time. I've accidentally discovered a few people I know IRL. I never outed them, directly responded to them or told them I know who they are. They were all past co-workers. Edit come to think of it my dad found my old account before this one. I had posted on the RAXJW sub, and my story was obviously me. He did ask me if I posted that. I found some acquaintances on Reddit posting a Halloween couple's costume wife posted. I originally met the guy of the couple at Global Reddit Meetup Day many years ago, so it was kind of funny to find his wife's account on accident. We don't really keep in touch anymore so I didn't tell them in real life that I found them. I follow my hometown Reddit page, and he happens to use the same name as his Instagram so it's obvious. We used to live five houses from each other, hang out and play Pokemon cards and hang out in his backyard in elementary school. We grew distant once I started getting female friends and haven't spoken since and linked me to my first Reddit account that I lost username and password for four years before when I turned in a work phone I got to get back into that one and get lost pictures I forgot I posted. My sister, a couple of my friends and one cousin. After confirming they are who I suspect via post history, they get a raised tag and they automatically get an upvote or down down vote whenever I see them in the wild. Haven't spoken to my cousin in over a decade and he's still an obnoxious little shit. My husband and I ran into each other on a specific dog breed page after he replied to my comment about the evolution of our dog's nickname. We didn't realize right away for that dinner I was talking about the coincidence and he realized it was him that commented even the internet is a small world. I had the reverse happen to me. I was talking to a new hire at my last job. She goes your single nut wonder right. Obviously I lied like a motherfucker and said no. You have to be there just like you. Nope, not me. I'm still really confused and creeped out by it. Yet, yeah. stumbled upon my math teacher's Reddit because of his unique username he uses it everywhere. Found out he's big into knitting and cat mems. Can't look at him the same way in class now. Especially when he's all serious about equations. I stumbled onto a former co-worker and found out they were trans while researching trans stuff. Myself lol. I never told them. But when I came out on Facebook they messaged me and said. I knew there was no way this goofy boy was Sizzlemau. Someone I know found me. I have IG and Facebook in terms of socials. That was fairly anonymous on Reddit. An ex-friend found a photo of me in the appearing sub and me a screenshot of myself lol. I do not use that account anymore. Happens all the time most people I know use Reddit, so it's inevitable that we're not going to run into each other. Gamer nerds tend to congregate and flock to similar medians. At least that's been my experience over the years. Once on our gay briskin meld. He was a guy I worked with when we were young. We used to double date and stuff, recognized him in an instant and commented something only he or someone in our friend group would understand. Found a girl I went to's with on here posting full nudes busting it open for internet strangers and talking about how her ex-husband saying she's gonna ruin her toddler's life with it made me sad for her. Saw a picture of some dude highlining in her slack line one was walking the line the other was mooning. Him. I scrolled past but felt I recognized both guys and went back to it. It was two of my best friends. I talked shit about my twin's cat in an credit thread about weird pets years ago. Then I sent it to her cause I threwly the thread was funny. She was very and amused I was out here slandering Willow. I found my cousin's Reddit account one day when he posted a picture. In the background, I spotted his mom my aunt. He posted a psycho of something that I don't remember. He's into furry porn. I haven't found anyone. But I've been found by my older brother. He told me. And that how the posts I make seem like the sort of thing I do. So, I was relieved that I'm not a weirdo here. Guy new posted an old photo on Blundias. His username is last name first name birth year. Which seems an odd thing to tell folks when you also moderate a porn subreddit. Yep. To people, 
and I know my boyfriends as well that I met him on Reddit, so I don't really count him. They both post the same shit they would post on Facebook or say publicly. I found my co-workers of Paige. She doesn't really advertise it and it's feet content only. I recognized a picture cause the background has my chair in the corporate office. Once I made a meme and posted it on Reddit. Then a couple hours later one of my friends sent in our group chat. It was pretty hard not to take credit to stay anonymous. My brother found me due to mentioning obscure family stories from both sides of the family thereby. Narrowing it down to one of our siblings in an discredit theod. Yes. It was a NSFW subreddit for an acquaintance's wife. I didn't need to know what my friend and his wife looked like when they're nude and fucking. But I do now. I've seen people in my Facebook punk rock gardening group post and comment in the gardening and houseplant subs. But I only know one or two of them personally. I found a post about someone I know. They are a flight attendant and a passenger called them out for good service. I shared it to our work group Facebook page. Found my older brothers from a post he made on a local subreddit. It was a very tame post about a play. Was shocked at just how boring his history was lol. My roommate lol. Was looking through some stoner subs and suddenly noticed a pretty familiar yard it was the same. Spot we seshed about 50 times or more. My friend popped up in a picture with a contestant from Drag Race his friend posted it and it did. In face lead me to new pics of the friend's friend. Some buddies I play Warhammer with. It's just in various Warhammer subreddits so nothing spicy. And I don't look through their profile out of respect. My ex-boyfriend from a really dark place in my life. It helped me see how far I've come because he's alone and miserable and I'm married and happy. 